Man, what's going on, y'all? Salute. This true results. Uh, we got to chop it up right now. I'm getting a lot of uh, phone calls. And when I get phone calls like that, and everybody pretty much talking about the same thing, we just going to hash it out. Salute to everybody. Um, a big unk popping out at this time in the game. Right now, they set another date. Let's see, next month for the uh, straight drops trial to begin. Right, I find the timing kind of suspicious, but that's my personal opinion. Now, big on. Um, You know, I give anybody the benefit of a doubt. But uh, from the street perspective, with with everything that's going on um, surrounding, uh, you know, from his hood, young mob and all that. And, um, you know, the, the, the um, feds and the, U.S. Marshals and the Homeland Security and all this shit going on in Memphis. Um, fucking Tate, boy, Everybody getting picked up. When everybody get picked up and they run these uh, multi-agency stings, raids, with the feds and the state, uh, it's on and popping. They, 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 they flipping, you know. They flipping some. And since the uh, MPD, the police department, is at the top of their list, it seems like everybody's scraping and scrambling. But let's get to the uh, point of this video. Let's go back to November 17th. And let just be non-biased. Let's just chop it up. From then, November 17, 2021, to right fucking now. What the fuck have all of us, what do we know that the fucking feds don't know? With me first. Everything, justice for dog, that's my boy. Like, all heart. Uh, all the sacrifices, all the fucking resistance, intimidation I have been through as one man. What do what what have we accomplished? And what have we shown? Since we know it's a whole new day. What have the feds um, did? Found out? What what information have we? Um, what information have any one of us used that they use? I'm talking about everybody around the board. Even the ones that fell off. There's only a couple of us still here. Everybody else, all that clickbait. You know. What have we... Um, what is the motive First of all, who the fuck led Young Dolph to Makita's by himself around Thanksgiving when every other, he been doing his turkey drives and shit for uh, many, many years. And this one time, this one time, 2021, 2021, November 17th. He dies at Makita's Cookies. Just him and his brother, right? It seemed like that's the trending um, topic. Um, and this is not no um, Young Dolph sector. This is justice for Dolph all the way. So when you hear that shit, 
Man, I came from I came from doing the same shit for Mo Three, uh, and walked away from that shit. This not no sector. This is only one mission: justice for dog. If you love them, do your part. The people should be scratching their head with this division, cause we not at a round table. How is it? How how does anybody with their love, uh, uh, everybody, and it's just one missing justice for a dog? Why are we um, divided? Ain't no king of no justice for no man. <laughs> Ain't no king of no of no justice. He represent all of us. And uh, we, a part we not representing, you know? All that ego tripping and shit. Man, that shit is uh, null and void. And if you look around the board, man, put all that, put all that information together, uh, even by ourselves. And we still ain't gonna be the police. We still can't arrest nobody. We still, if it ain't street justice or none of that, man, what the fuck the feds doing? And don't ever forget that the feds and the state and the police was not a favorite of dog. They wasn't his friend. <laughs> Let's go back. Oh, man. <laughs> man, dog had to ride paper tags and all this shit because they was because he was a target. He was being harassed. ATL, Memphis, and pretty much everywhere he go, they was shaking him up, shaking him down. And I recall an interview he did shortly before um, his um, transition. Well, he said he got stopped in the airport. Two million dollars worth of jewelry, 60 racks, and they took his phone. And uh, <laughs> somebody asked him, why you think they did that? He's like, I'm on the investigation. Investigation. In the street element, in the, in the streets, when you are under investigation, that scares everybody else, right? As solid as 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 uh and and and, and giving and you know community, you know all that. When 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 the feds harassing you and they they taking your phones and they tapping your shit and you under investigation, that instills fear and doubt and distrust in the streets, right? <laughs> right. Right. Everything that you have done. Um, if I can change anything, um, if I, if I can, if I could go back in time and talk to the flip of mine, I'd tell him the truth, but I think he already knew the truth. and didn't give a fuck about his mind. I think he felt uh, how deep that he was in the game on both sides. So he had no choice but to have no fear. What is that a fear? I'm too gone. I feel, I feel, um, Danger, evil on our sides, and 
my love and my giving. And look who I'm around. I got my kids set up. I didn't pull, I didn't, I didn't pull myself up out the mud against all odds. I didn't put people on. And now they want to force my hand. It don't take it don't take that much for a man to um, realize ain't no ain't no reversal and look who I got around me. Even my right hand man doubts me. The one that put me on. He never gets touched. But I'm getting harassed. I wonder. What would. Uh, a person. That so-called love you do for the fear of a Rico jail. I wonder would somebody that showed you the ropes and then you got bigger with a bigger voice and, and, and agitated the same thing that made him a ghost do with that political pressure and just the fear of what you can expose and what he been getting away with for many, many years. do to stay free sell you out back though you get you out of there and take everything you got see that's the one that makes a deal that's the one that's under political pressure you the one that follow his advice from that trap shit to that rap shit. You the one that he he brought his real estate guys and showed you how to move and don't put nothing in your name. But all the time he was your handler. These my boys, they been doing this. I been uh, yeah, surviving. You know with no um no 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 heat from the uh police. Yeah, I pay my tithes. But then you ain't listen. Now you brought this heat down and they on my ass. See, Daddy, I was there the whole time, from the very beginning, humble, humble beginnings. But what's love got to do with it? when the heat is on? You got to be silenced. See, I got to make a deal, or they gonna get, they gonna take it. Yeah, yeah. You pissing my folks off because uh, you off script. You beefing with this big head motherfucker. Quite sure that created some friction. Like, right, bro, we got the whole distribution and shit. We 
Yeah, the rap shit is good. For remember how we started. Now we can move around and uh, get shit out of town. All you gotta do is let this shit go. When you can't, when you can't, when the student becomes greater than the teacher, and you're doing your own thing, that's that's what a man's supposed to do. What the fuck you want to do? All that hush hush, play it this way. Got these young niggas around. See, I can control uh, what Daddy O probably was thinking. I can control the young niggas. You give them too much. You know what I'm saying? You breaking protocol and you bringing too much heat. Now you got the feds. My people, I pay my tithes to. Uh, telling me to do something with you. And then I got the industry that that don't like you neither. And I'm never the face of it. Now you, now you got the big head motherfucker bringing the powers that be that can stomp all of us out, including me. The young niggas are already easy to control because you trying to mold them into business, man. They just want to be rappers and uh, get the fame. They don't give a fuck that you got it out the mud. Spoon feed, so I can control them. And uh, we having meetings and setting, setting up shop because I'm gonna give them what you don't want to give them. And they can't wait. Should've took notes when Keith got set the stage. Bust up windows out your car. I thought there was a female that sung this shit. Drop my music. I'm spoiled. I ain't have shit. Not even your blood relative. Drop my shit. And then laughed at it. How you get that fucking spoiled? From love. And then the gang gang shit. Somebody tell me what my nigga was thinking. <laughs> to make it very interesting. Dolph was led to Makita's. Now, what if, hypothetically speaking, that the reason that he was at Makita's was just him and his brother, if that's how it happened? was not because uh, he was uh, fit to do anything with what with, with, with Makita's parking lot. He had the same turkey drive uh, in his hood. And everybody was supposed to be there. Go back to Raven. That dropped an old ass video of him and Makita shortly before he died at Makita's. And I know everybody uh, hinting around this shit for almost three years. But it makes you wonder what kind of deal was he at Makita's for? Did they want to, um, did, was he led there? Because somebody told him from Makita's that, um, well, this year we want to um, donate some cookies. Come, let's talk business. Was that the setup? Because until this day, we don't even know. If anybody, if anybody out there talked to Marcus that was there, can you please show us? Or tell us um, what Marcus said, if he really weren't justice for Doc. Because if I talk uh, <laughs> to Marcus, 
Man, he should already know. He should ain't never tell me shit. Cause I'm coming straight to y'all and let y'all know what the fuck he said. Ain't nothing he can tell me. But what the fuck happened? It don't gotta be exclusive, no blogging or nothing. It just a, it just to get the truth of what happened that day. So we don't have to be living out here in this fucking strange ass used to social media, anti-social media world where it's so many different versions and remixes of the untruth that you can start the day and say some shit. But what is the truth? So I don't buy that shit. And you can't hold that shit if you got, man, fuck that. Fuck that. And he was the only one that can tell us. Either you was in on it, or you should never be talking. And if you talk to one motherfucker, why the person that you're talking to? Guess you ain't see me, huh? It's all good. So, release that shit. The more to the story is, I think the trial said to start, uh, not in the next month, September. Cause my birthday coming up, August the 6th, don't y'all forget that. Uh, I'm gonna turn up for the first time in my life. A little big aunt doing the interview. Man, your name, uh, with the big money shit, I can't even prove, it's just a legend that um, a lot of people saying that True the Mafia got pissed off at Dolph for signing you because allegedly you took out Jay Money's brother. And that's, that's what caused the um, beef, the misunderstanding, the hatred. I don't know. I don't really do gang gang shit. Just want to know what the fuck happened. Ain't nobody talking. Nobody is talking. Damn. What, 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 what PR are you standing for? All y'all niggas that die put on can't even hire no the, the, the best goddamn private investigator in, in, the, in the country. Can't y'all can't tell it together to get, to get, don't y'all want to know what happened? Because silence, silence and, and with money don't you want results? Imagine it. Cause he fucking did. Man, I'm talking about, boy. They got the top lawyers, they got the top everything in, 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 in the country. All right, y'all got all that money, y'all tally ho. Then we'll know. And that's love. Better sick of sick the best private investigator on that head. Cause y'all got more money than true. And we'll get some fucking results. Find that kind of odd. That ain't nobody saying that, but ain't nobody lifting a fucking finger to unexpose the cover up. Shit, give me our money. They ain't got it. I wouldn't even hesitate. That's that's the real truth. So what the fuck are, you, are y'all fearing? I had a conversation with my brother this morning. Shout out to D. What are we talking about? What part Empire played in this whole thing? 
Uh, the industry definitely in this shit. And the streets as well. But see, that's the perfect recipe for the industry to take out the blueprint. A king like Dolph that's keeping all the money by his, <laughs> for himself and teaching other people how to be bosses, taking care of his community, buying up land, doing big business, on his way to a billionaire status. Damn near closer, he was just for to step back and start dropping and putting everybody he was eating. Last time I heard, he was to drop everybody um, solo project and uh, gonna take care of business. But they feared the business. So he would, he had his um, tentacles and his vision was major. And they already knew it. They already knew it. That he was so motivated. It's the same <laughs> barber. They used to talk to himself, and people thought he was crazy. So you gotta be from Memphis to know that. They used to talk to himself. Never thought he was crazy, but as time will reveal, he knew what the fuck he was talking about. And that's the only way you can stop him. Y'all can stop him. Because he had to be betrayed by his own people that he trusted. But he had no fear though. That's a king. That's a king. It's like the shit that it's like the title of his album that, that got a ego tripping motherfucker that want to be the king. I'll just say King of Memphis. That just mean a king. Big head motherfucker want to be the king. And one's gonna stop. That's a really bad industry guy. You can put your ass, you can put him on the, um, cover, we're talking about a hundred million dollars. Man, nigga, you can sell your soul for a measly a hundred million dollars. I think Dalton had this shit and still got it in equity uh, four, five times over. Real talk. Independent. They hate. So we let him go and don't do shit about it all the way to the end. You shouldn't have no fear at this point. That's all of us. What can we do in this world? But right. I don't do the flipper man. Like, share, subscribe. Looking kind of strange. And funny. I think it's time to untuck shit. That's why I be so hesitant. Cause I gotta be. It's too much hate. On this fucking app. And once again, this is not no fucking Young Dolph Sector. That's so fucking disrespectful. Ain't no king or no justice until we are unified in March. Look look how many greats have got their heads chopped off. You remember the Million Man March? Yeah, that's, that's unity. Yeah, let's, let's do better. 
or let's let's not uh, follow no um, fake kings that's really slaves. Cause I ain't ever had shit. And I ain't about no unity. They're about foolery. True. Cash out dollar sign true is on number two. Yeah. Yeah, true. Do what you wanna do.